What is up guys? Welcome to a brand new series of House Flipper. We're getting ready for the HGTV expansion pack release. I played this a while ago on, uh, on my stream and I haven't played it in a while, but I'm excited to be playing it again. We're going to start a brand new save and we're just going to kind of play it through, flip some houses, have a good time. I'm excited to be playing this, man. Uh, if you guys have never seen this game, it came out a few years back, I think 2018, and it's just about flipping homes. It's so relaxed. It's It reminds me a lot of... Uh, a lot of sims with how like relaxed and easy going it is welcome house flipper a game will allow you to buy renovate decorate sell homes so you're just flipping houses if you guys know what flipping houses is it's like buying a home that's kind of destroyed and just flipping it uh getting it fixed so you can resell it there you go that's probably the better way to define it so we're gonna clean some stuff up here this is gonna be our little house here we're gonna obviously clean up a lot of this junk that's just kind of laying around yeah, a lot of this stuff just needs to be moved, but that's okay. Let's go tell computer. So the laptop will allow you to find jobs, buy houses, switch between them. You cannot afford to buy a house yet, but looks like you already have an email. So let's go check. Your ex-boyfriend stole the radiator. Wait. Oh, not your ex-boyfriend. Ex-boyfriend stole the radiator from my house. I'd like to hire a company to put my house in order. I know from photos posted on Face Spam uh, that my ex-boyfriend broke into my house, made a huge mess and stole my radiator. Let's do it. So each mission, I say mission, I don't think I want to call it a mission. I don't know. Each project will have one goal or a set of goals. And then at first you're doing these jobs. So you go to these locations and do the jobs that they request. Then as time goes on, you start just buying random homes, flipping them as you please, decorate them, resell them on the market. It's so cute. So let's go see what's going on in here. Going to hop on in. House is destroyed. So we're just going to start cleaning up all this junk here. I love this game so much. I was really liking it back in the day. It's been a minute since I've played it, but I had so much fun playing it when I did play it. Ready, rotate. Go. I guess the first thing we should do is fix this table here. Clean this up a little bit. Keep cleaning. My favorite thing to do in this game, funny enough, is just cleaning. <laughs> I hate cleaning IRL, but in this game, they make it so fun. I forgot how to switch between items. There's a way to do it. I'm assuming it'll tell me how to do it. Oh, there you go. Right click. Now we can start cleaning. So, do, 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 do. Cleaning, 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 cleaning. But after a little while, we're going to start getting jobs and stuff. And the jobs are going to be so much fun. I can't wait you guys, uh, for you guys to see us flipping houses and stuff. It's so awesome. You got to look at all these different homes. Choose which one you want to like flip. Work from there. You are improving. Turn on the tablet to see where you can spend your skill points. We'll do that in a second. Let's just finish. Clean up this poor person's home. Dang ex-boyfriends. You know how they are, guys. You know how they get. Just ruin your home. Oop. I swear this looks like my home after I take my dogs for a walk in the rain. They just run everywhere and just destroy everything. It's the worst. Nice. Looks pretty clean to me. Alright, let's go install that radiator that they want us to install. Wait, back here. Okay, from now on your tablet, uh, you have your tablet at disposal, tab to use or hide it. It allows you to buy things. Got it. You can buy a radiator now. All right, first off, we need to upgrade our cleaning. We can do 25% faster cleaning, painting, handyman, whatever. Go over to the store. I'm going to go over to this, search radiator. I'm going to buy that bad boy. Just install it. So then we're going to do a little bit of assembly here. Nice. And this house is going to be good to go already. A nice quick flip there. Boom, baby. I think that's it. Do we hit all the 100% uh, done with the job? Uh, hit enter when you are done. And they're going to pay me $785 for cleaning up the house and installing a radiator. Maybe I should become a handyman if you can make that much money. What a move that would be. Soon we'll get a paint and stuff. It's going to be a lot of fun. I, I feel like I gotta clean up my own home. My own home's a freaking mess, man. 
this bathroom. I'm gonna need to redecorate. Head out here real quick. So like we could do the outside of the home too. They have a garden pack, which I uh which I did buy, and they also have the HGTV pack coming out soon, which is gonna be a lot of fun. Let's go back in and go buy another mission here. Oh, a few more emails. All right, radiators. I will pay you if I am fully satisfied or get nothing. Winter's coming. So that's install radiator. A bit of gravel and bushes. So this is the garden pack. We're not going to touch the garden pack yet because we'll do that for another episode. I don't want to start confusing you guys. Let's clean this garage. My, once again, dumb, but my favorite thing to do in this game is literally cleaning. It's like so relaxing. If you guys have never played this, I, I recommend you give it a shot. Game might be a little quiet. I can turn it up a bit. Nice. Wow. It's a mess. Let's just start cleaning up this place. Try to move the bike. Like, these need a. Oh, okay, wheels are fine there. We can pick up the other wheels and put them on the shelves, I guess. This is one of those few games. I have a few games that like are really on my wish list to make multiplayer. This is one of them. Did my time at Portia ever get multiplayer? If you guys have ever played it, I don't know if it ever got multiplayer. That game would have been cool with multiplayer. Stardew Valley was one of them. They ended up giving it multiplayer, but by the time they gave it to him, I was kind of done playing. I, I'll go back to it eventually, Stardew, I think. It just has been so long, and once multiplayer finally came out, I was kind of like, eh. Like, do you want to do it again? I spent, like, probably over 40 hours playing that game one week. When it first came out, I was playing with, uh, I was playing it on stream, if I recall correctly. And, and no doubt took a lot of time out of my day, but I really enjoyed playing it. No real complaints on playing that game. That game is a lot of fun. You've never played my time at Portia. I highly recommend it. Is this garage not clean? Oh, you can clean those up. Hmm. Does the tires need to be moved or something? What am I still missing? Oh, trash. This looks reasonably clean, right? Is this not clean? Some knickknack patty wax. It's here. Put this over here. There's a way to like sense what's around you. I think. Am I making that up? Could be making it up. I feel like there is. I just can't remember the key for it. Let me just run around with the mop real quick. The broom, mop. Unless if it's those tires, I think, oh wait, the tires are trash? Hold up, I think the tires are considered trash. I didn't realize the tires were trash. Oh, just the dirty tires. This looks pretty clean to me, man. I'm gonna say this is done. Unless you want the rest of the house clean too, I can clean it up. What a weird shaped house. There's a lot of weird designed houses in this game, but look at how cute it is. So this is what we'll end up being able to do is decorate these houses like this. Isn't that adorable? Dude, that sound, is that the sound of AIM? Dude, it is! Is that the sound AIM makes when someone comes into like, signs on? 
Yo, I think it is. That's so weird. I don't like it. Are these not useful? Oh, they look useful. All right, back to the office. Wait, do you want to save your progress? Can I submit the job? Clean the... Oh, wait, there's a dirty window? Oh, jeez, that's what it was. Squeaks. It was the window, guys. Sorry. I forgot there's windows in this game. Gosh, I was so inefficient of you just to scribble around the window. I know, guys. I actually regret it because now I can't find the last of the dirt. If you do it right the first time, you won't have to do it right again. All done. Woo! Yep, another $400 for cleaning up the garage. Yeah, another skill point. And I've noticed by using the gallery tab on the tablet, you can choose any image from your disc you use as a poster or image to hang on your wall. Open up your camera. Wait, what? What is it? They said, oh, camera. Oh, let's go take a picture of my house. Nice. Ding. Nice. All right, let's go do another job. We have a few more emails here. This is still the gardening pack. We'll save it for another episode. Walls. Bonjour. I want a little bit more arty. Can you please paint some walls in the living room? The remaining walls should be should look gray. Uh, should look stunning and gray. Oh, I almost forgot. Can you please replace a broken electrical socket? Let's go help out, girl Amanda. Hey, hello. Okay, congratulations, you got a new tool. From now on, you'll be able to paint walls uh, with a paint roller. You can do this in tablet mode. All right, let's go A, let's let's replace her socket she wants replaced. Screw that bad boy, take that away. Okay, we gotta unscrew this. Nice, take that off, nice. We got a new one. We're going to put in that. Nice. Screw these in. I've never actually, believe it or not, guys, I've never worked with electricity, so I'm a little scared. And then I guess we just go backwards. Cute. Nice. And then, boom. Cool. So we fix that. Now then, they wanted to paint which walls? These walls? Paint the... Paint with the colors... Amarith Adventure. Oh wait, I'm repairing something in here as well? Oh, your other socket. Alright, let's repair your other socket, then we'll... Then we'll go paint in walls. Nice. We can get points to make this go faster, of course, which we will end up getting points to make it go faster. We'll get skill points as we keep like working on this stuff. Right. And then when we go into this room, is this the room? Paint the colors. Something. Okay, let's buy that. Then we'll also buy the gray. All right, and I'm going to grab our new paint roller. What roll should we paint? paint? I guess the, I'd like to, I'm going to call this the accent wall. This 
This sound, I don't, I don't think I like this sound very much. Oh, it sounds so wet. It does sound like a paint roller to be fair. Like definitely sounds like a paint roller. Can't argue that statement. All right. Now gray, gray every other wall. You gotta get inside the window sills. This is another one of those things that we can upgrade as time goes on. It's pretty cool so we can upgrade the, uh, you can upgrade how fast you can paint, how many walls at once you can paint. Cause later on you'll be able to paint a bunch You'll do like three, four strips at a time. See, right now I'm doing one strip at a time. Later on, you can do like three, four. How much of, did she want every wall gray? That sounds so dark. Don't get me wrong, I'm no interior designer. You can tell by my Sim series that my interior designing has a lot to be desired, but gray on every wall just seems dark to me. But who who am I? Sooner or later, I'll buy a house and I'll be able to design it whichever way I want, but we'll, we'll play it by ear when I'm designing. I'll probably let my, my lady pick out the design because it's going to be way too much for me. I'm a simple man. I think white's a pretty nice color. You know what I mean? I always bust on my, uh, my parents. They, uh, a while back, they got their room repainted and my mom kept saying she wanted this color. Vintage Wedding was the, uh, was the name of the color. And uh, so I kept saying, Vintage Wedding, man. What the hell is that color? What is that? And she ended up painting the walls. Vintage Wedding, which was actually just white. I swear, I don't know what Vintage Wedding is. Maybe it was... Uh, Maybe it was the wrong color that she got, but it was clearly just white. And and that's my issue. I can't tell the difference between these colors. Like, if someone came up to me and was like, hey, just white or, I don't know, some other color, I'd be confused because I'd probably just say it's white. We're out of gray, but I don't want to buy more paint. So I think they're just going to get the rest of this wall pink. Hopefully they're not mad at me. I know I sure would be, but... Right now, gray, man. I'm not buying them more paints. They paid me enough for two canisters. That's what they're getting. You know what I mean? <laughs> we, uh, uh... We have these guys who come every time we need stuff painted. At my house. And we just call them the Italians. Because that's all they like to be known as. They're just hardcore Italian. Like, that's it. And they just love being known as Italian. They all have like Italian names like Tony and and Vic. Like just super Italian people. They're so funny. Love the guys. They're super great people. I just always get a laugh every time they come over because that's just who they are. And they're so funny. Really nice guys. Always talking with the hands. You know, being extra loud. I, uh, I grew up in an Italian family. My grandfather's name was Tony and... It was so funny every time you ever went out to like a bakery or something around here. Um, <clears throat> the bakers would yell Tony and every man would turn their heads because that was everyone's name where I'm from. I'm out of paint. All right, that's the end of your paints. That's it. That's what you get. Complete job. Uh, 91%. You'll get paid. Okay. Yeah, 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 I got paid. I got paid. That's all that matters. Yeah, so it was pretty funny. Anyways, guys, that's the end of my first episode. I really appreciate everyone watching and enjoying the content. It really means a lot. If you guys enjoyed the content, please consider looking down below and hitting that like button and that subscribe button. It would mean a lot. Two great ways to support me and check out the rest of the series. I'll have a link to the playlist in the description down below. So if you guys want to check out more of the series, we're going to just getting ready for the HGTV release. We'll be doing a little bit. We'll have a few more episodes before the HGTV release and then we'll be doing all that mumbo jumbo hopping into that and diving through the that lovely stuff anyways guys thanks again for watching catch you next episode